Hello everyone and welcome to a quick tutorial on how to add a 7TV custom mode. So when, you, when you've added 7TV, the extension, to your channel, you'll go ahead and you'll get these global modes that you can use in anyone's channel, right? But you want your own custom channel emotes from, from their database of emotes, right? So what you're going to do is you're going to head over to 7TV.app and right on the top of the screen you see the button that says emotes. So once you click on emotes, you'll go ahead and get a page of emotes that you can choose from you can also search right up here for specific emotes now what i suggest you do is play with this page so i figured out so initially you know i, I click on say i want to add cat kiss i click on it you can go ahead look at it in different ways and click add to channel now what i figured out which is super super helpful is when you're on this page like right now i know i want to add pepe meltdown you can actually just right click add to channel and from here, there's pages and pages of emotes that you can go through. I mean, we can add Alien Please. Look at that guy. He's vibing. You can add a bunch of different emotes. And once you actually add these emotes to your channel, if you head back over to Twitch, you'll actually see in chat, Sir Panafrost added the emote Cat Kiss. Sir Panafrost added the emote Pepe Meltdown. Each of the emotes that you've added now to your channel and it actually updates on the fly you don't you shouldn't even have to refresh your page you click down on the 7 tv below <clears throat> and just like that you can see the channel emotes the cat kiss that i just added the alien please you can see them vibing over there and just like that you got yourself some custom emotes if you have any questions about BTTV emotes, be sure to check the playlist up above. We're going to keep making 7TV videos. So if you have any questions, I'm going to be trying to figure out all the different things, such as seeing them in your own OBS or slobs, as well as different integrations with the extension. I thank you all so much for watching. I hope this was helpful. If it was, like and subscribe. Any questions, comment below, and I'll catch you all next time.